beautiful, sunny Budapest, probably not for long. At some point, there will be rain, yes. Do you like this track, though? Yeah, I grew up here. I have so many laps here. It's the first track I ever drove with a Formula car when I was like 13, so ask me about every stone of the asphalt, I'll tell you her name. You know, today I'm uh, doing what I love it's on my what is today the celebration of my life, my birthday. How old are you today? Catch 22. <laughs> what do you make of this track? I love it. Like the ambience of it, it's summer, there's so many fans, and they're like really fanatics, you know? They're really into the sport, it's crazy. It's just, it feels like home, even though like, I have nothing to do with this place. How could I not be happy on my birthday? Yeah. Doing what I love the freaking most. Lay <laughs> down on the sofa. Watch last year's events. The homework begins. Morning. Uh, I like this temperature. It's so nice. Are you gonna do what you did last year? Put it on I'll try. <laughs> With a quite big gap, even bigger than last year. But it's not easy because everyone is improving. Uh, the competitiveness of this championship is uh, incredible. It's for sure uh, harder for a driver like me um, because there are some rookies really fast, uh, as well you know some experienced drivers uh, really fast. And um, yeah, I need to push a lot, a lot more if I want to get a win uh, to get a pole position. Oh, the main one. I need you two minutes. Yeah, sure. Come on! <laughs> your trainer, if you can take it. Yeah, I will do after it's, qualifying. It's from Carrot. Did you check? Did you check? Uh, risk of rain 40%. There's a little shower going over the best. Copy. Oh, that is a big one! Come on! Thanks guys. Oh, to everything. We improved well the first sector, but we couldn't improve the middle and uh, last. So cool down, cool down. So yeah, some positive side. It's very good to do interview when you're freezing. It's a good brain training. Um, some positives. I love the track. The car is not bad, so you know what to do. I uh, kind of grew up here in Hungary. I have a very strong connection. My very first uh, racing experience when I was eight uh, or seven started here in the go-kart uh, tracks and then even in formula racing. My first ever formula drive was in the paddock of uh, Hungaroring. Still, my career to be is still open. I think uh, I've done a lot of F2. I enjoyed part of it, suffered part of it. The environment is very, very, very stressful. You are entering a sort of spotlight zone that any little thing you make, you feel that is being judged, either by the team, the fans, the other teams, the stewards, and uh, Brad is very young. I was back then as well. And everything gets under your skin. Everything. By now, me being the oldest and most experienced guy in F2, I think I have, I'd say, uh, the skin of an elephant. I don't even read what is being written in social media and so on, while Brad is asking me, have you read that comment and that comment? And I simply wouldn't care. Uh, about it, stick to your performance, focus on your job, care absolute zero about what's going on outside. Everything is possible, at least within the Nissani family. 
I'm not giving up on anything. I feel at home every time here. It's just such a vibrant city, so cool at summer evenings to just stroll around and uh, especially to race. The only one uh, starting on soft. Copy. All okay with the car? Yeah, okay. And we go F2 racing in Budapest. Race lead for Hauga. Cap 1.4. Okay, VSC, VSC, we box, we box now. Hauga looks up, sees the checkered flag first. Good job, mate. Good job. Very well done. Very well done. Solid pace. Well done. Wow! Yes! Oh, that's the good feeling you get. Oh, thank you, guys. Dennis Hauger, you are a winner again in a Formula 2 car. How does it feel? Um, yeah, it feels great. It's, uh... You know, been a bit of a tough season, but uh, it's, it's really enjoyable, obviously, to get uh, on the top step of the podium again. I mean, uh, the end is the sprint race, it's not the beach race, but it's still awaiting and it's nice to be uh, be up there again and show we have some good pace, so we'll try to do the same tomorrow, obviously, starting a bit uh, further back. I felt pretty good. Uh, it was joyful because uh, we planned on pushing hard at the start with soft, so against everybody on medium we were on the softer tyre. It was not enough. I mean, I really wish it was a safety car because uh, then it would have given us a proper, proper chance or a big opportunity. I'm cleaning it now because it was so beautiful before, and then now it just got dirty. Yeah. That's, that's the problem with going fast. Yeah. Today it wasn't much the case. Mm -hmm. So far, I have not once been on the lucky side because we've always been somehow on the entire strategy that wasn't ultimately the, <laughs> the better one, but you can never know. It's, it's just the gamble sort of thing. Yeah. <laughs> Saturday done. Yes, done and dusted. Let's focus in on this feature race. Trying to feel the same as usual. Flat feeling, feeling less emotional. Just a robot. Do it, returning back to the front of the field for the first time this year. Martin's losing out by half a tenth of a second. And we will go racing in five lights time. Good reaction time from Pop Sitter. Jack Dewey gets to the flag first! Beautiful. 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 Beauti
to have the joy, therefore the drive, of that activity. From there, once we're finished, we look at the results.